Hey there, everyone. This is Al Cal playing Ape Escape. Right. Okay. You know, I don't know. I feel like playing the game, but no. I should check this out while I remember it is there. But I did come in with the idea of running after monkeys, but yeah, like the ski thing thing just looks really involved. Like I kind of took a peep yesterday. Uh, I, I was a little overwhelmed. I was like, "Whoa, wait! This is like a whole thing with rankings and whatnot. Like, how many, how many races are there? Everyone is so flat." All right, so options again. Right. I looked at that and I was like, "You know what? It looks like what it looks like." Choose your character. <laughs> oh, hey, we get all the stats. Indecisive. He's paranoiac. Hospitable. Professor is pretty forgettable. All right, well, main character is normally pretty all right. Everyone's so flat. It's just like for qualifying. Okay, so. So there are many courses, by which I mean three. So you select the course, you qualify, and then each race starts on position by the qualifying run. First play of the game ends. So, okay. Yeah, tell me how this, this works. Right stick controls the right ski, and the left stick controls the left ski. This up to use jets, and also do skis, uh, pressing sides. Uh, good posture for my speed, uh, ski parallel, and crouch. Oh, you crouch. I don't know. Use jet without any capital letters in a use jet part. What? Okay, so, th yeah, this does look kind of complicated. Alright, well that's what I get. So I guess what you do is you go here, you select a course. Easy! We're gonna start with easy, now we gotta qualify in easy. Alright? So you do that, and then you mess it up a lot. Got it. So we got, like, everyone else's time up there. This is... Okay, but I think I can sort of get it here a little bit, except I'm lying. Okay, here's there were like two paths that I could have taken. Whoa! And then my skis are a little bit on fire because they're kind of like Jesse. You can't do that. Okay, see, now I'm gonna start third. So I'm not doing too bad in spite of having no idea what I'm doing. So you do a little bit of that. Like, how do you crouch? You mentioned it's crouching, but I haven't, like, done that at all. Whoa, hey there, Professor, you're so forgettable! I already forgot about you! Who it is that I just crossed paths with? I don't know! Alright, so maintaining a uh, third place sort of situation here. I don't know if I really care about winning, per se. But, you know, I, I want to do well. Uh, I want to do better than last. Alright, let that go. Is the other path then you get here and it's a bit yeah okay so you want to take the inner pathway there that was a good time a good a good spot trying to figure that one out it's pretty good Ooh, doing something like this for turning is pretty good I'm keeping the right stick up and just like changing uh, the left one but that's not always going to work got it but see I feel like qualifiers is a good time to sort of experiment with that I don't know why- oh, people are probably, uh, shining like that, you know, once they- Alright, uh, yeah. It's me! Whoa, I bumped! Alright, I feel like- and now you do final! Start in a position to achieve a quality round, competes for first place. You need to end with top three racers. So I want to be in at least top three. One. Here we go! See? Yeah. So, you know, I want to, like, finish the race myself. So if I can maintain me being here, that would be great. Monkey is in first place. That doesn't surprise me too much. Because Yonky is the goal of the game. I call it Yonky. Yeah. Much more delicious. Put it in porridge. You know what? Maybe I would do alright if I stopped bumping into barriers like that. I don't know. Just, just a thought. Just a theory here. Wow, Professor still hasn't finished a lab. That's kind of sad. All right. Yeah, I mean, you know, as long as I can keep Spike in my eyeball sight at some point, I feel like I'm doing okay. Professor, you're so slow. This feels like the kind of thing where you just, like, because of the way it's arranged, like, there's no real catch-up mechanic. There's no mushrooms and there's no shells, right? 
so it feels like after places are set up, yeah, I, um, the, the placement you're gonna do has a lot to do with uh, how you place for your qualifiers, and then I just run to walls all day long. It's pretty good. Because you, you kind of, you look at a mini-map, and uh, everyone is kind of very sparsely separated. But it's true that if I stop bopping into walls like that, that would be helpful, probably. It just keeps happening. I can't stop myself from... Yeah, that was kind of sad. I could have done so much better. But I also could have done so much worse. I made a third. It's fine. There's a replay. I'm covering the world with squares. See, I got a middle there. That's fine. It was just, that was easy. It's just called easy. But here's an actual level name. Snowball Island or something, I don't know. All right, here we go. All right, so here we go. Watch out, that's a tree. Don't encounter a tree. If you can help it. Whoa, big poster. And a large snowman that says, Hey, check it out, I'm made of snow. That's pretty great. Are you made of snow? What is that? Shark beat. That was extremely disagreeable. Not a fan of that sound. All right, so once again, starting in third, and uh, I'm probably gonna end in ter third, and I'm probably gonna finish the race in third. Now, someone's gonna tell me, oh, cow, if you get gold on some courses, that's how you unlock new courses. Well, you can see myself there in that, like, jungle time. And you know what? I will believe you if you tell me that. And, uh, it might get me to try a little bit harder, but it's pretty hard. So it just goes by your best lap, right, I'm assuming? Whoa, where am I? Without, uh, rank down. Yeah, so he just got a best, better rank than I did. Alright, that kind of thing happens. I'm not, okay. Well, you know what? Starting in two is pretty good. You know, starting in second place is better than starting in first place. We both beat Monkey. All right, so here we go. Dodge the tree is a... I said dodge! I... I feel like... Uh, I'm so bad. You see, and unlike qualifiers, like, everything here matters. Oh, what is that high-pitched sound? Is it part of the music? It's very disagreeable. I'm gonna say that. Oh, shoot. Dang tree! Who let all these tree grow here? This is a course! You know, you're supposed to maintain that course, and that means stopping trees from growing in it. And it doesn't matter if it's a car race or a ski race or what. And that's just common sense. Alright, well, I'm gonna get third. Uh, whoa, man, I should, like, dodge all the trees here, and that lets me catch up with a professor! Alright, that gun's gonna make me feel better if I can lap him. But yeah, I just... Whoa. Someone's kinda like let a fart and one like... Bow, bow. It's still going past him though. Like, that's still happening. Sorry, Professor. You exist to make me feel better. I would though, except I keep forgetting you exist. You know, I don't know what's up with that. Wow, yeah, like the, the winners there, like they already crossed the finish line. And here's that loud, piercing screech. It's pretty good. Oh no, they just meant they were on fourth. Didn't mean they, yeah, whatever, it's fine. Ugh, those trees! You just sneak up on me, you know? Tree ambush. But I get a medal. I'm okay with medals. No, just give me a medal. Make me feel metal. The Snake River! It's full of snakes in this fish. Be careful. Snake Town. Like, yeah, like, there are positions with your skis you can do, I realize that. But first, I need to, like, stop bopping into everything, you know? The reason why I lose placements is that. Because I hit walls, that slows you down quite a bit. Walls or trees, and sometimes you get, like, these completely ludicrous turns. Uh, like, what is that? Like, who let that happen? Alright, so yeah, you gotta go backward with your, like, other ski. And then you're kind of getting stuck here, and this kind of miasma. This is a long, complicated course compared to the other two. Truly has the soul of, uh, 
of the last course. I guess we're kind of in the cave now. This is very sunny. It's a very sunny cave. We're predicting a sunny day inside that cave. Wow, look at that. Like, I did terribly. Alright, well, uh, you know what? And my goal is to spin it, you know, to actually place. Oh, this is, this is an odd one. Like, the difficulty threshold between this one and the others is completely different. We have entered a completely different world full of fantasy, monster, and giant ants, probably. We just haven't seen them yet, but they're coming. You gotta do a turn like this. Don't ride the wall, that's not gonna... See, like, what do you do here? I feel like the um, tutorial, I can call them tutorials, the PowerPoint presentation I was given, did not really equip me very well with anything resembling knowledge. Uh, like, it's just saying, yeah, do that, do that, do that. And it's like, what? what? What does any of that even mean? Who cares? Do it! It's like, oh, alright. Yes, yeah, even in the qualifier here, I keep hitting walls. It's, it's really hard. It is a tough one. And then I hear some, whoa, yeah, I don't know where I'm going. It's pretty good. So, whoa, I'm so flat. We have to make people flat so the world can be loaded. So many NPCs and the map is pretty big. I'm getting lapped by Spike and... No, I'm Spike. Getting lapped by Jake and that's pretty sad. That guy's stuck behind rocks like an idiot. Alright, uh, I guess I'm racing from fourth. I mean, I could keep going, but I didn't want to. Yeah, see, if I stopped hitting walls, that would go a long way in being able to beat Natalie. So, that's my task for me. Alright, you know what? Opponent kind of count like walls, if you really think about it. It's a monkey! Look, look, just do what a monkey does. Like, but that's not hitting the walls constantly. I don't know why that keeps happening. Oh, jeez. Why am I all the way here? It's a mystery for me. So it becomes a mystery for you. Because in this strange sense in here, I am you. And that's why, you know, people start screaming at me sometimes. Because it's like if they were making all these idi hideous mistakes. And it just doesn't latch with their own self-perception. So there you go. I solve the mystery of parasocial gliding. Oh jeez, these snaky paths like that. I just get lost. Maybe there's a way to change the camera, I just don't know what it is. Monkeys is there. That monkey was just standing there. Now I'm in fourth and I can't do anything. It's pretty good. All right, you know what? It's not lost. It's nice to have a race that's actually kind of close in terms of my own personal goals at the very least. Not in terms of like, getting first. Well, I was never close to that, so... Yeah, like, I wonder what I'm doing wrong that I keep getting very close encounters with walls. Like, I feel like I'm playing okay, but that's clearly not true. And I feel like I'm playing worse over time? A little bit? And that's unfortunate. But yeah, like, it wants you to do, like, a pizza thing or something to go fast. But trying to do that, and look where that brought me. I'm as far away as ever from, like, being able to make the medal. Alright, you know what? I'm, I'm gonna restart. I'm just gonna try again. I just hit too many walls! I need to stop hitting walls. Stop hitting walls. That's all I need to do, man. See, look at that. I hit a wall. Oh, jeez. Where am I? What is this track? This course. This hill. Monkeys eating a tree, but I hit a wall constantly. It turns out, you know, it's. Yeah. The game controls weird. By, like, purpose. On purpose. By design. It's gonna have an impact. But I wish the impact wasn't so much wall hitting. Like, what do I do here? I don't know, man. 
it once twice. It's a little frustrating, then hit Natalie. And now I'm somehow in second place. Yeah, it's really weird. I mean, it's good that, you know, there's more, like, placement changes during the course, right? Like, that's a healthy course. Like, that's what it should look like. It shouldn't be like the prior courses where people kind of just immediately set up at, like, a comfortable spot and then never change from that. Like, in terms of spectator appreciation, yeah, like, that's just a bad time for everyone. Like, I am pulling down at that point. Uh, I guess you're supposed to start breaking first or something, because she didn't, like, slide out of control all the way there. Alright. See, like, I'm like, duh. You know? You gotta do it. That's the hard part. Go, 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 go. Good thing there's rockets on these skis, otherwise I don't think I'd be moving. Welcome to the rodeo appears. I don't know really where I am in space half of the time, cause the camera, it shows me while I'm here. Here I hit a tree, and I hit this tree again. I'm pretty good at that. If you need someone for a tree hit and contest, please consider me and bite me post with. Is that the word? You know what I meant. Now I'm just kind of jiggling around. But once again, we've all kind of stratified and we're all over town. Except here I messed up. So now I might have a monkey behind me as I'm struggling here. But you can see the green on the map. Unless it's Jake. I wouldn't mind it because that means that my third place would be safe. But, but that's not needed. That's right. Get out of here, monkey. Uh, I beat you, and that's what matters. I did it. Yeah, I hope. Whoops. I don't know if you can unlock other fourth grid. Oh, is that telling me where I'm? That's starting where I'm starting. I see. What a weird setup where you select course, and then there's like all these like things here. It's just weird extra steps. This is super neat, though. It seems pretty complex. It's just, there's definitely a learning curve to, like, actually manipulating the skis. I should look up on YouTube what it looks like when you, like, actually know what you're doing. Because I bet it looks super cool.